saw an article on MSN. And I'm sick, so please excuse me here. But anyway, a girl who was 18 years old was actually pimping out a 16-year-old. And it started out with oral sex. She take the girl out, and she makes so much money, and then she took like sixty dollars. Surely she didn't take the whole money. I will put the article down below. But this is the reason why the laws exist. This girl's eighteen, and the other girl is sixteen. Now, sixteen is the age of, of consent. Yes. Well, actually, I don't know if it is in that area, but even if it is, you can't do that. You know what I mean? You can't. Uh, prostitution is uh, illegal anyway. Except for in that one place where they have uh, these women inside this house. I forgot where it's located at, but they can actually legally prostitute. I think it's in Texas. Anyway, um, this is the reason why those laws exist. Because, see, we don't know if the police or the parents stopped Caitlin Hunt from doing something devious with this 14-year-old. You know, this girl... It didn't say in the article that she's been in trouble with the law in the past. Maybe she wasn't. She's 18 years old, you know. Uh, there's a good shot that she was a good student at school. It didn't mention anything about fights. It didn't mention anything about anything else. Just that she did this. And see, people do make mistakes. Yes, I understand that. And that's what people keep saying about Caitlin Hunt. Is that, you know, kids make mistakes, but should they have to suffer for the rest of their life? Well, the laws were put there to protect people that could not legally consent. And that girl, you know, the 14-year-old with Caitlin Hunt, you know, she wanted to be with Caitlin, okay? And people are saying, well, she consented. Well, she didn't consent because legally she cannot. She can try, but she cannot. And anything that she does with an adult, that adult can be in trouble. And so we don't know what was going to happen in the future. There could have been threesomes. There could have been anything. And that's that's the thing about it. You know, I've experienced this in my family years ago in 2004. You know, uh, a statutory rape happened, and it was recorded. And uh, the people that recorded it wanted uh, uh, this person to babysit for them, just like she had babysitted for the people, for the person who was doing the statutory rape. So... What do you think they were going to use that tape for? They were going to use it to blackmail her. Duh. I mean, you know, if she says no, then they can always use the tape in order to get her to do something. And in this case, this girl, it, you know, the 16-year-old with the 18-year-old who was doing the uh, prostitution stuff, she, the oral sex, oral sex, it seemed like it was okay. She wanted to do that. But when it came to sex, she kept backing out. She didn't want to do it. It didn't want to go that far. Well, that's the whole point. Now, eventually, if the money got high enough or something like that, she might have done it. But people found out about it, reported it to the police, and thank God it stopped. Like they said in the article, it's, it's rare for a teen to uh, do sex trafficking with a teen. It's usually an adult. <coughs> that's interesting, because 18 is an adult. The article is not really saying the truth, are they? The 18-year-old is an adult, legally, all over the place. All throughout the United States of America, 18 is legal. You're an adult. So the 16-year-old, it isn't a teen pimping out a teen. It is an adult pimping out a teen. All right, read the article. Let me know what you think. But do you see what I'm saying? When you catch something that's legal and you stop it, it could have advanced. It could have went farther than it was supposed to go. You know what I mean? If you're lucky, you got to cut off. And then no more damage. I mean, there's already damage. I mean, for crying out loud, people are going to know that she prostituted. Everybody's going to know that she pimped her out. That's going to be around her neck for years, you know. Uh, people are going to call her a whore, a slut, another person. Who knows what they're going to call her. Uh, it's, it's a terrible thing, and people shouldn't be doing it. And that is why the laws exist. Follow the law. If you can't, then you're going to have to pay the consequences. All right, you guys have a good one. Take care, and God bless.